We've done many projects in the Gambia looking at how communities can benefit from tourism. What I was looking at was the different approaches that we have taken. For example, consultation. It's necessary to consult the villages or the communities to know what their priorities are. You know, it's not one just telling them this is what we need for you, but for them to say this is what we want. Uh, the other aspect is looking at research, for example. You need to do a proper research to find out whether at the end of the day the money that is derived from tourism can benefit uh, the locals. Uh, the other aspect we looked at was uh, to see whether it is possible to reduce all the imports that come. Uh, to countries and to destinations by actually getting local farmers to supply to hotels. So different projects I was looking at and the approaches, the various approaches that can be taken, consultation, work with the private sector, uh, work with government so that you have a collaborative approach uh, before you can actually implement a project. The conclusions are of course you need to do all that. I mean you need to look at uh, working with different stakeholders. Uh, so that the different stakeholders see it as a benefit towards what they are doing, so that you have a win-win uh, situation. Uh, you need to build capacity, for example, of these locals. They have never been engaged in proper businesses. So you need to build capacity. You need to establish a proper foundation of relevance and, 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 and a research base so that at the end of the day, it can all go to benefit the communities and destinations.